This video is how to do a bundle of digital either ebooks or audiobooks on BookFunnel and Shopify. It assumes you already know how to do a single product because this video is only about doing bundles. Now bundles and box sets are not the same thing because a bundle is separate files and a box set is the one file. When you're selling on the retailers you'd be used to a three book box set for example. You might put it on Amazon because you'd have to price it under $9.99 for the royalty issue but you've probably got bundles wide. Most people have three book box sets. Why do they call them box sets? But we don't call them box sets on the store and why is that? Because customers typically think it's going to come in a box and you don't want customers thinking your ebooks are paperbacks. That's the number one cause of confusion. So call them bundles. Now you don't put them in separate files. You do put them in separate files if they're bundles. If they're a box set, they're all in the one file. So you could say sell 10 ebooks in a bundle, 20, 10, 5, 6. It's up to you. And the good thing is when they're a bundle, they're separate files. When you use a three book, for example, box set on the retailers, you put them all in the one file. So if you have, for example, vellum, you would put the three books in the one vellum file and so on. But the good news is, and same with audio books, you know, you'd have to stick them together. But the good news is with BookFunnel and Shopify, they're separate files and you simply make one product and the one product contains the separate files. So we'll get on to the tutorial, how to do it now. And don't forget to like and subscribe and comment if you would like to see a tutorial on something else. Now, this is how to do it, but I'm assuming you already know how to link a single product, a single ebook or a single audiobook on BookFunnel. So this I'm only showing you now how to do a bundle, a bundle of ebooks or a bundle of audiobooks. And the first most important thing to note is you don't put them in a single file. So for example, you're probably used to doing a three ebook box set on the retailers, maybe not Amazon because you know over $9.99 and they cut the royalty right down. But if you're wide, you'd be used to the three book box sets, but this is different. You don't put them in a single file they're separate files and BookFunnel will deliver the separate files. It's a good idea also while I'm on the subject to make sure that you say which is book one. So if you've got a six book bundle and it's all in the one series and they need to be read in order, um, in order on BookFunnel clearly mark it like I might have Witches Brew book one and that way the customer won't be confused and read books out of order. You simply go to Shopify and call it whatever you want. Call it a bundle. Make sure you note that it's an ebook. But use the word bundle. Simply tell them it's a bundle. It's all very straightforward. And then make sure your image is of a bundle of ebooks. Again, don't if they're ebooks, make sure they look like ebooks. Don't make them look like paperbacks. That will cause a lot of buyer confusion and make them possibly upset and angry because they are expecting paperbacks. Even though you might say ebook 65 times on your product page, if you've got an image of a paperback, people often don't read and they will skim. So make sure you have them looking like ebooks and you can group them like this. And the important thing is you assign your bundle a SKU, a stock keeping unit. You can, for barcode ISBN, you can simply copy and paste the SKU. That's not important. But what is important is the SKU. And as always, uncheck or untick, depending what you say in your country, track quantity and also untick this item requires shipping. First, pop over here to manage and to make sure you deselect Facebook and Google. This only affects free stores, not your ads at all, but both Facebook and Google utterly despise digital. You will see some slip through on Facebook, but they will email you about it because they don't like it. So call it whatever you like. Mention that it's a bundle. Put a description in here. 
put your image here, make sure you add alt text for SEO and make sure you show whether it's a paperback bundle or a hardcover bundle or audio or ebook. Of course, set in the price and then put your SKU. Save it and pop over here to Book Funnel. Go down here to Sales, go up here to Delivery Action and select New Delivery Action. All you have to do now is copy and paste your title, copy and paste your SKU and here, this is where it's different. Here you would choose a single book if you were doing simply a single book sale, but here you can choose as many as you like. I will just randomly choose some to show you what to do. So these will all appear in your bundle and that's how easy it is. You just proceed as normal. But if I had a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, I could do an eight bundle here if these were all audio books. But this is simply the difference. Instead of selecting one book in this section here, books to deliver, you simply set as many as are in the bundle. You pop down here, copy and paste your SKU, your store link, everything else and proceed as normal. And that's all there is to it.